I never watch Alex Jones and in fact I hardly watch anything at all because my task and priorities lie in revealing to you that Switzerland is the true base of all evil. But yesterday on June 27, 2015, I couldn't resist to peep into AJ and see what they say about the beach attacks in Tunisia, as if I was sort of led to do so. <laughs> oh boy, what a freak show. After 3 minutes 13, uh, Paul Watson started to struggle with something inside him and you can hear it rumble. Then his eyes flickered and completely turned another colour, as if something trying to come out of him while he was struggling to push it back. You look at France where today's beheading took place. They had a poll last year in August which found that one-sixth of French citizens had a, quote, favourable view of ISIS. And then a staggering 27% of people aged between 18 and 24. That's not the case. You look at France, where today's beheading took place. They had a poll last year in August, which found that one-sixth of French citizens had a, quote, favourable view of ISIS. And then a staggering 27% of people aged between 18. As a historian, I don't know what it is, but it's undeniable. I'll put the URL link in the description below, and maybe some good editors like Pronstar Criminati or Marino Delfino can show that creature better, as I just filmed the screen and only took some screenshots. Last year in all, last year in all, last year in all, last year in all, 20, 20, 20, 20. It seems this is going to be the year of the beast with all these creeps popping up. And in the video, this freaky thing tried to scare us concerning Islam, instinctively knowing that these Muslim dudes know exactly how to handle the entire goddamn freaky horror show we're in. Last year, last year, last year, 2020, 20, 20. These freaky things are really scared shitless of Islam, so they try to set us up against the Muslims and have us deal with it for them.